everyone welcome back to my channel so today i'm starting off dry face i feel like my mouth is so rusty like around my mouth gets the driest out of everything like if i yawn right now i'll look like i got a white crusty mouth and that's a problem Let's pretend you didn't see that. <laughs> so today I'm actually going to do a little get ready with me. It is the new year 2020. So I want to start off with a little chit chatty video with you guys. So um, yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and do my makeup and talk with you. You know, about life, what I did on the holidays, what I did for New Year's and whatever, you know. And then like goals for 2020, you know. <laughs> off to a fresh start for a new year. I cannot believe it's 2020. Like, that's just weird to say. 2020. I mean, I like it. It sounds cool. It looks cool. But 2020? It's funny because back in the day, like, whenever we thought of 2020, I'm pretty sure we thought of flying cars and stuff. <laughs> but the farthest we've gotten is Teslas. <laughs> But anyway, <clears throat> let me go ahead and get started as I'm talking. So I'm going to go ahead and moisturize my crusted dry face with, with Ule Hendrickson, the Sea Rush Brightening Gel Cream. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Literally love this stuff. So I'm going to go ahead and moisturize. 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 I did not slip you off. I promise. I was just showing you I had product on my finger and it just so happened to be that finger. All right, so we're just going to moisturize. So again, can't believe it's 2020. Um, but to start everything off, why I'm filming the second week of January is because it started off my 2020 sick AF. I heard I wasn't the only one. Like I heard everybody was sick at the beginning of the year. So I was not the only one. I'm getting right back on track now. But y'all, I literally, like, I thought I was good. Everybody was getting sick around me, and I'm over here like, oh, I've been taking my airborne vitamins. Those is working. For the holidays, I was around sick people. Like, one person got sick, and then the whole family got sick, and then everybody got sick. And then I'm just sitting here like, I'm not sick. And then came home a week later, still feeling great, you know? And then Joyja was supposed to come over, and we're going to watch you. And oh, man. I wanted to watch it so bad, but she got the flu. And I was like, girl, you're not coming over to my house with the flu. I'm sorry. I am sorry. You know, felt bad, but I didn't want to get sick. You know, I already passed up the sickness. So I was like, nah, we can wait till you're better. And I'll wait until you're better and we can watch it together. So did that. Real quick, I'm going to use Laura Mercier's Tinted Moisturizer. This is the Illuminating Natural Skin Perfector in the color Golden Radiance. But anyway, so I told her, yeah, sorry, you're not coming over. And then guess what? After me talking all that mess, I fell asleep with my fan on. Woke up. <laughs> I was like, no. All right, it's just a sore throat. We'll see. We'll see what it how it goes. And then I went to the gym that exact same day, and I'm like, dang, my throat is hurting. And then like my gym where I go, when it's cold outside, it's like cold inside too. And I'm just like <gasps> breathing, and it's hurting so bad. And I'm like breathing into my <sighs> breathing into my sh shoulder, my sleeves because it was hurting. And then I was just like, no, I hope I don't get sick. And then next day, felt even more sick. I didn't have the flu or anything, but man, I thought I was getting like sick sick. I thought I was like, I went and got a thermometer just to be checking my temperature to make sure I wasn't getting like a fever. I, did, I never got a fever, but I was coughing like crazy, nose was running like crazy. I just had like a really bad cold, which was rude. I did not want that. Next, I'm gonna conceal with Laura Mercier's uh, Flawless Fusion Ultra Longwear Concealer. This one's in the color 4W. So yeah, so for the holidays, I went to Chicago with my man. Um, yeah, it was really fun. 
It was actually the warmest Christmas Chicago has ever had since like 1980 something. Yeah, I was going out there expecting to be freezing, bought big jackets and everything. And it wasn't even cold. I mean, it was like, okay, it was like 60 degrees on Christmas. And then like after Christmas, it went down to like 30. But still, it was the warmest Christmas they've had. One of the days we went downtown and it was 30 degrees and I was pretty darn cold, you know, cause 30 degrees is cold for me. I'm used to this LA weather. Um, my boyfriend's family lives out there. And so like we all went out there. He celebrates Christmas there every year and I got to go with him. And yeah, I said boyfriend. I've had a boyfriend for a really long time. Y'all just didn't know if you didn't know. Some people knew, some people don't know. I mean, well, there you go. I got a boyfriend. I did have a boyfriend. And a lot of people think it's new because like, if you go on my Instagram, there might be a little picture of us on there. There might be, and it might be like, ooh, fire. But anyway, yeah, so, I mean, people think it's a new thing. Y'all can think that. I've known him for like, really long time. Um, I'm gonna use Laura Mercier's translucent powder to set my face. You know, I just be like hiding my nails and whatnot. How dare I? Um, but yeah, for those that don't know, you, you now know. Um, shoot, some people been known because they peeped my stories. If you watch my stories on Instagram, You've seen him since like two years ago. Um, yeah, some people are just now peeping him. But anyway, so I went to Chicago. Yes, it was fun. It was. I really liked it out there. It was so pretty. Like downtown, anywhere else is disgusting. Like New York, ew. And then like Los Angeles downtown, there's like nothing compared to that. It was so pretty. If you've never been to Chicago. Man, it's so pretty. I was like, dang, I like it here. I'm gonna use Sephora Micro Smooth Powder and go all over my face. But yeah, so Chicago is amazing. I can't wait to go back. I wanna go back in the summer because my boyfriend says it's like amazing in the summer. So we're gonna go back. So we went there for Christmas. We went there a little bit before. We were there for like two weeks, I think, or a week and a half, something like that. And then we came back to LA for New Year's. Um, Too Faced Chocolate Soleil Bronzer is up next. Um, and then after that, well, we went new for New Year's. What I did was we just spent it here at my place. We were making vision boards for 2020. So cute. Um, it was like a chill New Year's. Um, I liked it. You know, it was cute, but what else? And then now we're in 2020. And I started off my 2020 great because I actually got to go to the Golden Globes. Ooh, it was so fun. And it was such a cool experience. Like I loved it, Beyonce was there. I breathed the same air as Beyonce. I didn't see her with my own eyes because they like come in their own secret way. They didn't go on the carpet. They kind of just snuck in, sat down, brought their own bottle of wine. And yeah, so like I saw her on this, and I didn't see her with my own eyes, but she was there. I breathed literally the same air as her, so. Great way to start 2020, y'all pay. I so would've wished, like, I so would've wished I could've gotten like a picture. If I ever get a picture with Beyonce, Man, ooh, okay, anyway. Uh, next up, I'm gonna use this Natasha eyeshadow palette. It's the Sunrise palette. It looks like this. Look how beautiful that is. I'm gonna go ahead and get Jasper, which is like burnt orange color right here. We're gonna put that on the eyes. But yeah, so Beyonce. I just wish, like, come on, man. I need a picture with Beyonce sometime in my life. Like, sometime in my life, I need a picture with Beyonce. That will be my goal. Shoot, I'll make that a 2020 goal. I really hope to be around Beyonce to be able to get a picture with Beyonce because Beyonce is just queen. But yeah, so now that I am over my little sickness, videos are going to be rolling out. Like I tell you, I was coughing like the nastiest cough 
ever in my life. It was like disgusting. Glad that's gone. I got like a, <coughs> like a little cough here and there, but it's nothing like it was. So pretty much the fact that I didn't want Georgia to come over, I was like, I should have just had her come over. I would have been sick sooner and I would have got over it sooner. No, I'm just kidding. She actually had the flu and I'm glad I didn't get the flu. I would have cried. But anyway, so we ended up watching you. We were both coughing all night, you know, but she came over during the day and we literally watched all season two in one sitting. If you haven't watched you, you definitely should. That show is amazing. There's season one and season two are out now. If you haven't watched it, get on it. Season one, it's so good. I hope there's like 20,000 seasons of this creepy guy. Like he's so creepy, but it's so good. Another Netflix show that if you haven't watched is Jane the Virgin. Yo, Jane the Virgin is literally like my top. Jane the Virgin, you, there is one other show that I really liked. I forget what it's called, but Jane the Virgin and you are my top Netflix choices. Now I'm going to get this color right here. It's called Azalea, right there. And I'm gonna put that right on top. It's kind of like got <clears throat> pink shimmers in it, but it goes good with like the orange. Like it's so cute. I actually, dang, I actually think I want to put some orange down here before I put that up. Yeah. Go ahead and bring that orange, burnt orange down on the eyelid first. Because it's not super, super like um, intense so that I could, I saw my skin through it and I don't want that. There we go. Now we're gonna put that color right on top. And I'm going to mix clay spring. It's this brown color right here, right on top as well. So it's going to be a little mixture of brown and pinks. So it's not too intense like pinky. Yes. 2020 is like such an exciting year. Like I'm so excited to like do big things this year. Like, <clears throat> I don't know if y'all are ready. I don't know. I'm getting get this Laura Mercier palette. I don't know how to say that, to be quite honest. But it looks like this. Nice and then like that. I'm gonna use this color right here, it's the gold. And then I'm gonna put that, the lighter gold, and put it in the inner corner. Just right up here. Oh, dang, there's like so many other colors in this palette that I wanna use. One and then that one. Ooh, this ain't the last you're gonna see of this palette. It's too fire. Now I'm gonna use a NARS Orgasm blush. I'm so excited to travel this year. Like, I don't know where I'm traveling yet, but last year I traveled so much. I went to so many, like, different places that I never expected to go to. So I'm excited for this year to like experience that again because it's like the best. I feel like that's my favorite part of my job. That's one of my favorite parts of my job is, well one obviously is getting to help you guys and like teaching y'all new stuff about hair and makeup, all of that. But like another thing is like being able to work with these brands and travel. Favorite part, like. Like me, I would, I will not pass up a trip. I just, I just can't. They're just so like amazing. Like I'm so thankful to be able to work with brands and go on trips with them. Next, I'm gonna use Hourglass is Arch Micro Brow Sculpting Pencil. Cause like I've been doing like real natural brows lately. So I don't mind if it's lighter. It's a good color though. It's not too much. It's not like whoa. That's not like whoa. Looking at my, looking at your, your whoa. Speaking of little dances, how do y'all feel about TikTok? I feel like TikTok is blowing up. Like when I say blowing up, I mean blowing up. <laughs> 
I have a TikTok and I make TikToks. Um, I don't make them religiously, like not all the time. But I do when I'm bored, you know. When I'm chilling and I'm bored, I'm like, let me make a TikTok. Follow me on TikTok if you aren't already. I will put it right here and I will link it. It's pretty fun, honestly. The app is very entertaining. I, I could get on TikTok when I'm bored and stay amused for quite a while. There's just so many different like videos on there. But yeah, I, mean, I make a few TikToks here and there. So if y'all wanna follow me, go on ahead. It's Jasmine Brown. Someone already took my Jasmine. I'm gonna try to get it. <clears throat> well, I don't know. I don't really mind having Jasmine Brown to be completely honest. Now I'm going to use the Hourglass Arch Brow Sculpting Gel. I like the way this brush is, to be honest. It's like fluffy on one side and then like more dense on the other side. Okay, next I'm going to get this Haas Laboratories Liquid Eyeliner and this is the in the color brown. I'm going to go ahead and do a little brown wing over here. I love brown eyeliners, they're just so cute. Oh, Jasmine, what you doing? I actually, I really actually made that line really long, but I'm gonna make it work. Dang, that's a long wing. I was trying to do a little baby cute one and then just boom, that happened. All right, I'm gonna work with it though. Oh, wing is so sharp. That worked. To be completely honest, I ain't mad at it. Now I just gotta see how to do it on the other side. Let's see. Whoever lives above me, like I don't know what it is. Like you know when a marble is rolling on the ground and it makes like a weird growling kind of, like it makes a weird noise? I don't think y'all can hear it, but something weird just be going on up there. And it's weird, like I don't ever hear my neighbors like up there at all, like at all, besides this little I don't know what the sound is, but it's very weird. It sounds like a stomach growling. Like, dang it, you're hungry. Now I'm just gonna curl my lashes. Um, I'm gonna use Laura Mercier's Caviar Volume Mascara. Mine rubbed off because I just use it so much. This is one of my favorites. I have two favorites. Caviar, Volume, and It Cosmetics um, Lash Blowout. These two become in head and head, to be quite honest. I love them both so much, I can never decide which one I wanna wear. So today, we wear a caviar. We're gonna go back and forth, baby. So, speaking of 2020 goals and vision boards and stuff, I have so many goals this year. I can't wait to get all of them done, you know? If it's in my mind, I gotta get it done. Like, I'm not just gonna sit there and think about wanting to do it and not to do it. You just gotta get to it and do it, do it. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Wait, that song? I think that's a song. Comment below if you have any like goals for this year. I wanna hear, I wanna read goals. I love reading goals, it's just so inspiring. And then I'm sure by y'all reading like everybody else's comments down there is gonna be even more inspiring. And yeah, so let's leave comments below of 2020 goals. I have plans to do like tons of different kind of content. Like content that I've been wanting to do for like ever it's gonna be it's gonna be on this year like just be waiting for different content more than just hair and makeup like i'm gonna do it all be ready like you're gonna be like what why is she making this what it's so cool like i, I cannot wait and i even just like fix my like my studio a little bit more so when you got a sit up studio like ready to film all the time oh you're ready to film every day and that's what i did so, I'm gonna use Laura Mercier's Face Illuminator and Indiscretion. 
indiscretion. But to give us a little pop of highlight. Do I have anything else to talk about before I'm like almost finished? Okay, so I'm gonna use this ColourPop lippy stick in the color Ziggy Matte. Anyway, it's this. You can't see it with my lights. This is a good color. Mmm! This is probably like my favorite lip color. And it's super cheap. It just goes on so well. Like, if you ever see me wearing a lip color on Instagram, you're like, what color is that? It's probably this one. And I'm just gonna set my, hmm, I kinda like the matte look. So I don't know. Sometimes I spread my face and I'm like, dang it, I, look do I looked better matte. Or I like the way the matte looked better. So I think I'm just gonna leave it like this. That's a TikTok dance. I learned that TikTok. Do y'all know that little TikTok dance? It goes. Woo! Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> yeah, that's a TikTok dance I learned. I actually didn't want to do like the TikTok dances, but I found my little itty bitty hands and I was like, ooh, doing my TikTok dance with the little hands. So, but anyway, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, a little chit chat, you know, a little update on my life, what I've been doing, what I did for the holidays, and what is coming for 2020. Some I can't say, but I can't wait. And I hope you guys can't wait either. But yeah. Oh, ooh, I like this lip color. It's so nice, isn't it? Y'all, get this lip color. I need to go stock up on these like and get like a whole bunch of them just so I never run out. Ziggy Matte with ColourPop's Lippy Stick. <laughs> anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Happy New Year to you guys and I hope to see y'all. I was gonna say I hope to see y'all, so, but basically I'm gonna be seeing y'all if you're watching my videos. Hope to see y'all in many more videos. <laughs> yeah, so that's about it. I'll see you guys in my next upload. Bye.